Hey Shug, welcome back to Nisi Girl Tarot. So wanted to do like a little check-in love messages. What does your person want to say to you? Now, of course, the messages can be flip-flopped and reversed. So maybe this is what you want to say to your person. Okay. Um, but uh yeah, I'm gonna lay them out for each zodiac sign and then I'm gonna clarify why. Okay. <laughs> um it's all fun messages. If the reading doesn't resonate for your zodiac sign, do check your other placements, but also don't apply if it doesn't fit. Um, and yeah, we're just having fun. Okay. Um, using the hidden truth Oracle. Okay. And, um, what else did I want to say? I think that's it. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Yeah. Let's see. So I already did my pre-shuffle. Let's cut it and see. All right, so bottom of the deck says, I can't stop thinking about you. So collectively, this can be someone that either you can't stop thinking about or they can't stop thinking about. You. Yeah, let's start with Aries, okay? What does, um, Aries, what does your person want to say to you? You and I were too young, okay? Okay, we're going to clarify that message and see why. Don't worry. Taurus, what does your person want to say to you? You were the best thing in my life. Okay. All right. I like it. I like it. Gemini, what does your person want to say to you? I buried myself in work to forget you. Dang. Okay. But we're going to see why, right? <laughs> okay. Cancer, what does your person want to say? I feel you leaving me behind. Okay. Could be having some issues. All right. But they definitely can't stop thinking about you. Leo, what does your person want to say? I'm so attracted to you. Mm-hmm. All right. Yep. Virgo, what does your person want to say? I wish things could be different. Okay. Libra, what does your person want to say? I wish I could share my good news with you. Okay. So this could be someone you haven't spoken to. Um, Scorpio, I love you. <laughs> Point blank emperor, right? Okay. Sagittarius, sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. Okay. Yeah. You know, because the overall message was I can't stop, right? Capricorn, I wish I had treated you better. Okay. Yeah. That's what they want to say, Cap. Aquarius, I want to tell you how I feel. All right. I want to get something off their chest. And Pisces, I know I messed up everything, okay? All right, so let's clarify these messages, people, and see why these messages are here, okay? <laughs> let's, let's do it, let's see. All right, let's go with, I'm gonna use this deck for the first six, okay? Zodiac signs, and then change decks up, okay? All right, all right, all right, all right. All right. For all signs. This is for Aries. Let me try to come out. The death energy. Okay. All right. So it says, you and I were too young. Why is this message here for Aries spirit? Please make it clear. Why is this message here for Aries? You and I were too young. For Aries spirit. Please clarify the message for them. Seven of Swords, the Seven of Pentacles. Okay, so um, the Seven of Swords is about lying, still and cheating. Okay, yeah. Um, someone might not have been honest. Okay, with you, um, maybe was being very strategic, um, or sneaky even. Okay, with the Seven of Pentacles, um, maybe waiting for some type of financial stability. Okay waiting for some type of um, independence, either on your end or theirs, okay? But this is as you and I were too young. Why is this here? Yeah. With the hangman energy. Yeah, and the hierophant. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Someone wasn't honest when they uh, might have shared with you. They were like, seeing things differently when it comes to like being in a commitment and like you know home and family okay yeah 
with the six of swords judgment tower in the moon it's like I feel like judgment with the tower is like all of a sudden there was a judgment made, okay? Um, and with the moon energy, you might have been like taken back by it, okay? Or it might have, you know, caught you off guard with that seven of swords energy because you weren't aware of it, okay? You weren't expecting it. Why is this um, you and I were too young card here for Aries? Okay, yeah. Three of cups, okay? Um, this could be a, a third party involved, okay, with the chariot energy and the six of pentacles that they are moving forward with, okay, with the hermit energy. You might not have heard from this person, okay, or may not have just known like that was their plan or that's what they're moving on with, okay. This can also be with the three of cups, this can also be um, like family and friends, okay, um, that could be influencing someone to move on or to move forward, okay. Um, and maybe someone is, you know, speaking up about this and saying, you and I were too young. I wasn't honest with you and I should have been. Okay. So let's see. Why is you were the best thing in my life here for Taurus? Why is this message here for Taurus? The eight of swords. Okay. Yeah. You were the best thing in my life, but with this Eight of Swords energy, I just couldn't tell you, okay? The Eight of Swords energy is about stuck energy, okay? Feeling stuck, feeling restricted in some way with the sun card on the bottom. You're the best thing in my life, but I can't tell you. Why? Why you can't tell me that, right? Why is this message here for Taurus? You were the best thing in my life. Okay, with the Strength card, Leo energy, okay? And the Ace of Swords, Okay. Um, they might have pushed you away, resisted the connection, okay? Yeah. And, and this is why, okay? With the Ace of Swords and the Two of Pentacles, this is someone that is fully aware that they were juggling, okay? They were um, not reliable, that they were on the fence, okay? Okay, so that's why they held back, held back, okay? You were the best thing in my life, okay? Someone feeling restricted, like, yes, you make me happy, but I can't have it, okay? So I'm going to resist it. Okay, you were the best thing in my life for Taurus. For Taurus spirit. Six of Wands, the Knight of Swords. Okay, with the um, Six of Wands and the Knight of Swords, okay, this is about success, achievement, accomplishing something. Someone now knows they have to take decisive action, okay? They have to get it moving, okay? You can't keep being on the fence and going back and forth and back and forth and expecting success, expecting things to pan out, okay? It's not. So someone I feel is um, gathering the strength and the courage because they want to achieve something with you. They want some type of success, Okay, um, but they've been avoiding, you know, the obvious or, you know, avoiding making a decision or putting things off or whatever the case may be. Um, and they're seeing that that's just keeping them stuck. Okay, I bury myself in work to forget you. This is for Gemini. Why is this message here for Gemini? Okay, the devil, Capricorn energy. Okay, someone's... Um, Addiction could be work, okay? Someone is addicted to work with the Eight of Pentacles, okay? Yeah. But they're trying to, I feel like uh, with the Temperance and the Three of Swords, okay? Someone might be doing this to avoid uh, feeling what it is that they feel, okay? Um, they might might be doing this to um, overcome some type of heartbreak or disappointment, okay? Why is I bury myself in work to forget you here for Gemini? The Seven of Cups and the Four of Pentacles, okay? The Seven of Cups is overthinking, okay? And Four of Pentacles is holding back or holding on to, okay? Um, the Magician and the Six of Cups. Mm-hmm. Four of Cups and the Ten of Cups, okay? Um, so this is someone that may be away from you, okay? 
Um, and they're trying to create some type of way to get in reconciliation, get things back moving. Okay. Um, someone's over, someone's unhealthy trait could be overthinking with that seven of cups, worrying too much, um, being selfish, only thinking about themselves, holding back. Okay. But the magician and the six of cups is someone that wants to type of, wants to create some type of reunion, um, because they miss you. Okay, the fourth cups is a missed opportunity. It's like I'm missing out on the, the one thing that makes me so happy. Okay, on my ten of cups, my happy ever after, my emotional satisfaction. Okay, why is I feel you leaving me behind here for cancer, spirit? Please clarify this message. I feel you leaving me behind for cancer. Okay. The Emperor on the bottom, Aries energy. Okay. Okay, so this is somebody who's like, I don't want to be a player no more. <laughs> okay. So with the Nine of Swords and the Three of Pentacles, okay, someone could have sabotaged the situation completely. Um, and with the Three of Pentacles and the Knight of Cups, um, they, they, they are now uh, taking steps, ownership with the Emperor energy, um, taking the lead to get things back on you know get on the same page with you get things back moving get things back into balance okay um with this knight of cups energy this can be a romantic gesture taking you on a date or something like that um with the seven of pentacles nine of wands and the knight of wands it's like i looked at a situation and all of what is causing me you and everyone else involved with the nine of wands right um which is which develops or brings about pure exhaustion say one thing after another and it's because of my actions right it's like how i'm not consistent how i'm in and out how i'm a player how i'm you know doing the same crap over and over again okay so someone definitely sabotaged the situation um and this is someone is like who might have taken time to look at that and they're like i don't want to be a player no more okay i want to take step up with this emperor energy all right, and take the lead in this connection. Okay, two of wands. I'm choosing a path. I'm making a decision. I'm actually clear on what I want now. Right? Yeah. Okay. I'm so attracted to you. It's here for Leo. Why is this message here for Leo, Spirit? Why is I'm so attracted to you here for Leo? The Ten of Swords and the Two of Pentacles. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm so attracted to you. Someone could have uh, experienced some type of ending because they couldn't make a choice. They couldn't um, figure something out. Okay. With the Eight of Wands energy and the Page of Swords. Um, this can be someone that's sending communication out to you now because maybe they understand something. They realize something. They understand what the problem was, okay, with the five of wands and the seven of wands. It's like, I know what the problem was. I was being defensive. I was, you know, um, putting up walls. I was, um, you know, guarding myself, okay, and but that's changing, okay? I want to change things. Yeah, I'm no longer indecisive. I'm no longer on, on the fence, okay? This could be someone who you experienced some type of ending with that is communicating some type of realization, okay? Communicating um, some thoughts to you, some ideas, okay, some emotions even, Okay, yeah, because they're so attracted to you. They could even be flirting with you. Yeah. We have, I wish things could be different here for Virgo. Why is I wish things could be different here for Virgo, spirit? Please make it clear. Yeah, eight of cups, the tower, and the fool. Dang, you straight up banning somebody. <laughs> or they did it to you. Okay, with the Eight of Cups, the Tower, and the Fool, someone walked away unexpectedly and took another direction. Okay, they definitely went into a whole nother direction. Okay, with the Five of Pentacles and the King of Swords, High Priestess, you feel completely left out in the cold. Someone made a decision that you were completely unaware of. Yeah. And they just like, I wish things could be different. Really? That's intense. I feel like I need to clarify that more. I am. Okay. <laughs> I am. Why is I wish things could be different here for Virgo? 
I wish things could be different. Why is this message here for Virgo? Why is that message here for Virgo? Okay, so we have home. Okay, can you see that? Can you see that? Yeah. All right. So it says cozy, warm, secure. You feel at home with each other and hesitation. Okay. Past heartbreak, broken trust, afraid to move forward, but split energy and offer. Okay, so someone, even though you felt they felt so connected to you, you guys might have had a home together, you felt like home. Someone was hesitating, okay? Um, hesitating on making an offer with split energy and offer, okay? So unexpectedly, someone walks away, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's crazy. All right? Anything more for Virgos, spirit? Anything more for Virgo. I wish things could be different. Ten of Pentacles. Okay. Six of Pentacles. Can, yeah. Yeah. Okay, but this Ten of Pentacles energy, it's like, it, it kind of looks like someone is going into a direction with a, a partner or into something that they feel is um, divinely guided, okay? Um, the King and the Queen of Pentacles. Anything else for Virgo? Okay. Yeah, to, to go into a whole new direction, okay? Ace of Wands and the Four of Wands, okay? This is a whole brand new relationship okay someone could be leaving a ten of pentacles situation that they were giving to to start something totally brand new okay and their message is i wish things could be different yeah go with that okay let's um clarify these next six zodiac signs okay for libra Scorpio, Sag, Capricorn, Aquarius, and Pisces. Please make it clear. Okay. So Libra, you have, I wish I could share my good news with you. Okay. So again, this could be someone that you haven't spoken to. Um, maybe someone you had a great friendship or a bond with. Why is I wish I could share my good news with you here for Libra? For Libra spirit. Okay. Okay. The Emperor. Aries energy, two of pentacles, and the four of wands, okay? Will of fortune and a lover's justice, okay? <laughs> yeah. All right. So, someone is definitely stepping up, okay? Yeah. Um, if they were indecisive about in the relationship or were juggling you in a relationship. Maybe you had a relationship with this person. You had, guys had a great bond um, and you are not talking to this person with this emperor energy. Someone might take, might want to take ownership for the um, imbalance in the connection. Okay. Um, with the will of fortune and the lover's energy, they feel like you are their divine counterpart. Okay. Um, and it's almost like they want to do right by you. Okay. With the justice energy and the six of pentacles, it's like, I want to, 
give to you more, okay? I want to do right by you, okay? Yeah. I, I It's like I didn't do right by you before, okay? It's like um, someone wants to take ownership, take the lead, okay? Step up in a situation, okay? This could be definitely someone that you have very close bond to, okay? I love you is here for Scorpio. Why is I love you here for Scorpio spirit? I love you for Scorpio. Okay. The Queen of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, Seven of Wands on the bottom. Yeah. So someone someone could have pulled away. This could be an earth sign um towards Virgo Capricorn. Um, but someone could have pulled away from you or abandoned you um, because they were trying to avoid some type of like uh, drama. Okay, this could also be someone that's like that pulled away from you because they might have felt like they needed to protect you from the drama. Okay, yeah. Seven of Pentacles, right? And the Two of Wands, okay? Um, yeah, but the King of Pentacles now on the bottom. Mm hmm. They could have been, um, there could have been some type of like, a commitment or obligation that has come to a close or that they are closing, okay, with the will of fortune and the lovers, okay, they're making a um, decision and maybe after reviewing a situation, okay, choosing a path, all right, choosing to go in a different direction, all right, this could be that Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, all right, mm -hmm. they could have had um, like a baby mama or something or someone that they, a mother figure that they were, um, allowing to like influence or create that drama that they were trying to protect you from or to uh, alleviate okay yeah so someone has someone that abandoned you or left you on the code or walked away um has taken time to review a situation and they are choosing to go in a different direction they are choosing a path okay with i love you being here they may i feel like they're choosing you okay so let's see, why is sometimes I stay away thinking about you here for Sag, for my Saggies, Sagittarians? Why is this card here? Okay. The Nine of Pentacles, the Ace of Cups, okay, and Justice, okay. So the Nine of Pentacles is about stability, okay? Um, it's about being single and ready, right? Um, and the Ace of Cups is like, I stay, sometimes I stay awake thinking about you is because maybe they're thinking about, um, you know, like how good looking you are and how stable you are, responsible, like how well you're doing. And, or this could be someone that's recently single, okay, or um, more stable. And now they feel ready to start something new with the Ace of Cups, wanting a new partner or wanting a new relationship. With the Justice Energy and the Six of Pentacles, Eight of Cups. Okay, this could be someone that um, you might have had a breakup with, okay? Um, and maybe it wasn't the best breakup, okay? But could be someone that is um, like almost like once a second chance, okay? Why sometimes I stay away thinking about you here for Sagittarius? Okay. I feel like this person is now separate from something and wants a new beginning for Sage. Okay, Five of Swords and the Moon. Okay, Ten of Cups. Yeah. There could have been a lot of gossip that you weren't aware of, okay, with the moon energies, you know, like it's like the hidden and the unknown, okay, especially with the moon energy coming out after the, the, the five of swords. I feel like it's a lot that you don't know, okay, a lot that was being said that might have left someone feeling like defeated, like I can't make this happen, this ain't gonna work, okay. Um, with the nine of pentacles, I feel like they're feeling more stable now, okay, feeling ready, feeling prepared, feeling independent and ready to start something new, okay. Um, the five of swords can also be like my mind's playing tricks on me, but I feel like it's because other people were talking, right? Yeah. Why is I wish I had treated you better here for Capricorn? Capricorn, why is this message here for you? I wish I had treated you better for Capricorn. Mm-hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm seeing things from a whole new perspective, right? With the hangman energy. Okay. Yeah. I held back how I feel. Okay. Yeah. I wasn't honest. Okay. Seven of Swords. That wasn't right. That was foolish. Okay. Yeah. Someone's seeing things from a whole different perspective. They held back their emotions. Okay. They held back emotionally. And maybe they didn't come off in their in the best energy in their actions. Okay. So because it says, I wish I had treated you better. Okay. It's like they held back. They didn't give all. Okay. This turned over, going back in. Um, with the six of swords energy, this is about moving on to common waters, moving on to the better place. With the star energy on the bottom, okay. Queen of Wands and the judgment. Okay. Yeah, the star energy with the Queen of Wands is healing and recovery. Okay. So someone could be seeing things from a different perspective. They um held back from you, held back emotionally, okay. Um, held back. And is they might be ready to move past that, okay? Um, move past whatever they did to not treat you the best, okay? With the star energy and the queen of wands, someone wants to heal the situation, okay? They might want a second chance to come together, all right? Yeah. We also have, I want to tell you how I feel with me for Aquarius. I want to tell you how I feel for Aquarius Spirit. Please clarify. Why is this message here? Magician. Okay. And the death card. Okay. Okay. Nine of Wands in the world energy. So there could have been or there could be an ending that is occurring right now. Okay. It says, I want to tell you how I feel. Someone manifested an ending. Okay. Um, it's like with this nine of wands energy, something became too much. Okay. Someone, something became too much. And so basically like someone just asked God to just close it out for them. Like this is too much. I don't want it no more. Right. Um, I manifested this ending. I want to tell you how I feel though. I don't want you to feel like. Oh, you know, it wasn't real or, um, you know, everything was uh, BS or something like that. It's like, you know, things were just really heavy. Things were a lot. And I just needed the cycle to close. I just needed a fresh start. I needed a way to kind of just move forward. Okay. With the chariot energy and the uh, eight of wands and the will of fortune. Someone wants to, um, to, to tell you, to talk to you, to tell you, you know, how they feel and why things changed the way that they did. I want to tell you how I feel for Aquarius Spirit. I want to tell you how I feel. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The Seven of Wands energy is blocking, pushing you away, okay? Someone might have pushed you away, you know, doing, you know, in the connection or whatever the case may be, right? Um, but that's just because they just weren't happy. Okay, with the Four of Cups, it's just not something they wanted. Okay, they were dissatisfied. Um, and with the Page of Cups energy, they want to apologize for that. Um, but Justice here and the Six of Pentacles and the Star, um, the right thing to do, okay, or um, the right thing, yeah, the right thing to do, or maybe they're recognizing the right thing to do, yeah, is to um, do better give more um like not half ass situation mm -hmm. breadcrumb that's what i was looking for okay and then we have for pisces i know i messed up everything why is this message here for pisces i know i messed up everything okay with the knight of wands energy and the five of cups yeah it was like I was being a player in and out, not being uh, reliable, not being consistent, not being responsible, um, taking this for a joke. And I'm so sorry for that. Okay. Five of Cups. That I'm, When I look back at my actions, that was, listen, I know I messed everything up, right? Yeah. With the Three of Cups and the Three of Wands, okay, someone could have had a third party, okay? Um, someone could have just kept you waiting, Um 
there was always like other people involved, friends or something like that, where they were always, you know, keeping you waiting. Okay. And with the six of wands energy, this could be because they just wanted attention. It's like someone just like, you know, seeking these other parties or seeking these other people just for attention. Okay. It's like allowing your need for attention to inter interfere, right? Why is I know I messed up everything here for Pisces? Okay. It's like someone regrets, like, you know, allowing their friends or third parties or whatever, like, get them all caught up off attention, right? Yeah. I know I messed up everything. Yeah. Past breadcrumbing. You can't make it up. Mm -hmm. Given to the past. Okay? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, given to the past, bread from it in the past. There are some actions that someone is really looking back at and they're so like, I regret all that, okay? Yeah. So that's what I have for you, Shug. I hope this helped. I look forward to seeing you guys soon. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Miss you guys already. Bye. <laughs>